we will be talking about natural hazard which is one of the important topic as far as the exam is concerned so natural hazard could be of two type it could be natural as well as anthropogenic so in present scenario because as the human beings are developing we have a huge tendency or probability of getting a hazard event so what do we mean by an hazard <clears throat> sorry so any unwanted change in earth's ecosystem which is detrimental to human sorry and to associated biodiversity is referred to as natural hazard means whatever causing a problematic situation for habitable biodiversity in ecosystem that is referred to as hazard and as far as india is concerned the, there are following natural hazards are of significant importance like we have landslides we have floods we have seismicity or what you call as earthquake we have volcanic eruptions we have cyclones we have droughts we have avalanches in himalayan belt we have forest fires we have tsunami we have communicable disease so these are the hazards which we will be studying in detail one by one so let's first talk about earthquake or seismicity so as all of you know earthquake is a very common phenomena or seismic event which is caused by seismicity so earthquake or seismicity could be caused by the following reasons like so we have asthenosphere layer as all of you know we have taught in the structure of earth so it has a radioactive elements so in asthenosphere you have radioactive elements where due to nuclear fission lot of energy is released which leads to the melting of asthenosphere and as a result we see that approximately 1% of asthenosphere is in molten state then these earthquake could be due to convergent plate boundary or convergent plate movement or convergent plate movements of the earth so they, they, they can also cause seismicity then we have the divergent plate movement right so it also leads to sea floor spreading and some of the features of the seismicity or the earthquake events are like seismicity is basically a sudden motion of earth crust caused by abrupt release of energy that is stored in rocks and earthquakes are common on all three types of planetary boundary layer or sorry the plate boundary that is convergent plate boundary divergent plate boundary or conservative so all sort of plate tectonics leads to earthquake then for example